Good morning, I'm Brooke Hapes. President Trump will be in Milwaukee today to tour Adurco Aerospace. According to the Milwaukee Business Journal, the company has filed expansion permits with the city of Milwaukee. President Trump will also hold a private fundraiser while in town. A number of people are in custody after a drive-by shooting last night. Police received the call around 7.15. When they arrived on scene on the 1400 block of 14th Avenue, they were able to find the vehicle involved and arrest the suspects. The homeowner says she believes her home was targeted because of her son's relationship with a girl. Some brides and their families say they haven't gotten a refund for their wedding deposits at the now-closed Darboy Club. The 57-year-old supper club closed at the end of June. People with weddings booked there say they were told they would get their deposits refunded, but some say they're still waiting for the $600. I'm meteorologist Michael Fish, and we got a cool front on the way. And you notice late this afternoon, maybe like towards Anago, Cribbits popping a isolated shower, a thunderstorm, and then the rest of us going to see the chance of a couple of these working their way on through as we head through the evening. They could bring a gust of wind or a little bit of hail, but not everyone going to see that. And by the overnight, most of that should be out of here, and actually most of the weekend looking all right. 86 though this afternoon, the winds picking up, the humidity picking up as well. They had chance of a thunderstorm well off to the north and then the rest of us, these chance of scattered thunderstorms heading through the evening. And then as far as tomorrow, the way it looks right now, mostly sunny for most of the day, less humid, 83. That's not a bad day, cooler lakeside. As far as Sunday, warming it up a little bit more, but the humidity still not too bad. But starting on Monday, there we go with that heat and humidity going through a lot of the week. In each one of those days, we could see a thunderstorm, but it wouldn't last all day or night. But we'll keep an eye on that, get the timing down for you. So you can download that news app. It's free. You just search for WGBA. It's in your app store.